Okay, you can see we're looking at the sun right now. This, oh my gosh, that was fast. Oh, I can't have you off trail. I just got kicked out of my spot. Whoa, what was that? Flew right by Jupiter, that was insane. Hey everybody, welcome and good afternoon. So today I took a day of vacation to do something that probably nobody else is doing today. Uh, and that is to do some astronomical observations. So the goal today is to find Jupiter in the middle of the day, which if that's not hard enough, Jupiter is not exactly very close to Earth, and especially at this time of year. Anytime on those planets that are outside of the Earth's orbit, um, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, any of those, if they're out during the day or if they're near the sun like Jupiter is today, it means they are very far away. They're on the other side of the sun as the Earth. So that's going to be a challenge for me. Um, but really the big challenge is just going to be finding it. Uh, hang on, I'm going to show you a view through the, through the telescope and then show you the pictures that I get out of this. When you post-process these pictures, they can come out amazing because what you do is you take thousands of pictures in a really short period of time, you use software to stack it together so that it throws out the bad images from the waviness of the atmosphere, keeps the good ones, and then keeps the good parts of each section of the planet from each uh, picture. And, it, and you can end up with some really good pictures. So hang on for that, I'll show those uh, when I'm done. All right, so right now I am aligned to the sun. This is another challenge in the middle of the day. A telescope like this, to get aligned, typically you'll do three stars in different parts of the, uh, of the sky so that it gets a feel for where you are, and then you can just type in Jupiter and it'll go right to Jupiter. The problem here is there's only one star in the sky right now, and that's the sun. So I have a, what's called a single star alignment going on right now with the sun, which means the telescope doesn't really know exactly where it is, but it's got a rough idea. Um, so that's a, that's a challenge I'm going to run into right now. Uh, but we're looking at the sun right now through a filter. Uh, I'm going to bring you over here and uh, we'll go try to find Jupiter. It's pretty cool. You can see some sunspots on there. Um, beautiful clear day. So uh, we got to go get over to Jupiter. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over to my software and say go to Jupiter. Um, which, like I said, is not going to be very accurate. But we're going to zoom in on it here. So. Let's uh, just say find target and uh, Jupiter and we'll say go to target. Okay, the telescope's moving over there right now, or at least in the general vicinity. Okay, so it thinks it's on Jupiter right now. Uh, if I'm actually on Jupiter, I'm gonna go buy a lottery ticket. Okay, so this is the view from the telescope. Uh, I've still got that solar filter on there, so I need to take that off. All right, it's really bright out here, and this is going to be a challenge. So I, uh, I put the old towel over my head here so that I can see my computer screen really well. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to try to grid search around where the telescope thinks Jupiter is. So you can see the green is where my telescope's pointed at. It didn't get Jupiter right. Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh, that was fast. That was fast and that was easy. Okay, uh, let's get over there. There it is, it's really small. So I can zoom in on this. This is gonna be awesome. Okay, so I've got this thing kind of in the center of my scope right now. I'm gonna change out some lenses uh, to really see if we can zoom in on this guy. And see. How's it going? Hey, good, how are you? Good, I'm Gus, I'm the property manager here. Oh man, you're gonna kick me out, aren't you? Well, can't have you off trail doing anything. Yeah. What you got going on? I'm just, I'm actually looking at Jupiter. Are you? Yeah, That's I just cool. wanted to get out of the neighborhood because there's too much heat coming off the houses and stuff. I tried to, close, oh. tried to get as close as I could to the trail. <laughs> if there's a spot wide enough where you're not impeding people on the trail, you can do that, but I, got you. I just can't have you off trail. This is going to be so painful. I just got kicked out of my spot. I was about 10 feet off the trail. I'm glad I didn't go to any effort to put to get more uh, distance uh, off the trail than that. I got to pack everything back up into the backpack, find someplace more public, find Jupiter again. It's an hour long process. This is so painful. And I missed my window for, uh, for good seeing. It's kind of gone to average seeing. So hopefully we can still get some good images of Jupiter. Uh, I'm not 
super hopeful. Good news is I'm in a beautiful spot, but packing up, moving someplace more public. Okay, this is super frustrating. I moved, I set up in a new spot. I'm, the good news is I'm on a like a public bench here, so I don't think I can get kicked out of this spot. Uh, the bad news is the wind has picked up, the seeing is not quite as good, so I'm not as hopeful with these images, but I cannot find the freaking planet again. I've been looking for about half an hour just doing grid grid searches. Oh my gosh, I found it. That is so frustrating. Whoa, what was that? Oh, that was super cool. And that was super tiny, whatever it was. I think I just caught a satellite. Unfortunately, it, it was completely out of focus. Wow. Okay, I have it. I have Jupiter. That was insane. What are the chances I would find it right as a satellite goes zipping by? That was epic. Oh, oh my gosh. That is beautiful. I can't believe I found it. It's actually pretty clear too. I'll be able to get a little bit closer here. Okay. It's going to be really blurry live like this. I can't believe I found it though. So I've got it. It's not ideal. The atmosphere is not as calm as I wanted it to be. But I think at this point, what I'm going to do, I'm going to try to dial in the focus and I'm going to take some pictures. Hold on. I'm going to show you at the end what those pictures end up looking like. Hey, I'm about to take off here. I was planning on being out here for like an hour or two. It ended up being four hours because of all the uh, extra stuff going on. Uh, I'm gonna go home and process these pictures. You'll see the pictures in a second. Hey, if you like what I'm doing here, give me that like. Uh, if you wanna see more of it, give me the subscribe. If you got something you want me to do, throw it in the comments, uh, or if you've got any other ideas for me.